More city council member Robert Krause sits at the head of the class most days, teaching math at Moore High School. It's a profession both of his parents held, ultimately leading him to carry on the tradition. I think I take a little bit after my dad and a little bit after my mom. You know, my dad taught government history and was involved a little bit in politics, you know, in terms of doing some campaign help. And so I kind of followed my dad with the, with, the, with the politics a little bit, I guess. And, and my mom was a math teacher. You know, so I think I kind of, kind of just kind of fell, you know, under her wing a little bit, I guess, and kind of went that direction and uh, came naturally into teaching math. And then Krauss has his own direction, wrestling. Despite a wrestling injury as a kid that left him partially paralyzed, Krauss has dedicated himself to the sport, serving as head wrestling coach for Central Junior High and assistant coach for Moore High School. Just absolutely love it. I mean, it's a wonderful sport. The kids are great, you know, you have a chance to watch kids you know, from the 5th, 6th, 7th grade all up to their senior year. So I get a chance to really bond with those kids and just watch them grow. Krauss also has a sports history of his own, having played on the U.S. wheelchair rugby team where he traveled the world for a period of time, representing the United States in the sport. It's in addition to skydiving, which he's also done. A little bit of a risk taker, I guess. You know, and, you know I'm a wrestling coach, wrestling, wrestlers aren't right in the head. You know, so skydiving was, I think, a natural thing for me to do. All the while, Krauss has been teaching math, coaching wrestling, and competing in international wheelchair rugby. He's also been a city council member, 10 years to be exact, long enough to see real progress during his tenure. The fact that Moore has just turned into a city that everyone loves to be in and wants to come to, you know, we've really improved the quality of life in Moore. Um, you know, businesses want to come here now. You know, usually if you wanted to go eat at a good restaurant, go watch a movie, uh, you know, anything along those lines, you had to leave the city. Now you can do all those things here. People actually come here to do those things now, so uh, that's what I'm really most proud about. And what do his students think about having a politically connected teacher? Most of my kids don't realize it. You know, it's not, being on the city council is something that I, I publicize, I don't talk a whole lot you know, to them about. Uh, but once they do, it's kind of interesting because some of them will you know, talk politics with me a little bit or ask me what's going on with this or that, but some of them didn't phase them at all. They get careless, some of them. They don't, they're not amazed like I thought they would be.